Hi, I'm Chris Manners with SFGov TV, and you're watching Coping with COVID-19. Today I'm going to the grocery store. Now, I'm not an authority about the virus. I'm just showing you what I'm personally doing. To find out the most definitive and up-to-date information about the pandemic, I'd highly recommend the FAQ that's available at sf.gov. I want to minimize my time in the store, so I'm taking a paper list and I won't be browsing. Before I leave, I put a sanitizing wipe and a pair of gloves into a plastic bag. I'm wearing a mask and I'm taking the smallest number of items with me, just my car key, credit card, ID and the bag. I'm not taking my phone with me because even if I use it to pay, I often have to either touch the pin pad or sign the screen anyway. I'm concerned about cross-contamination. I don't want to transfer the virus from my gloves to the phone and then to my face. When I get out of the car, I put on my gloves and get a grocery cart. The essential workers at my local store are doing a great job. They're sanitizing every cart and limiting the number of shoppers. Having a cart can help you protect your space if other shoppers forget about social distancing. In this store, there are two new signs on the floor. One is directional to encourage everyone to take the same route around the store. The second is to remind shoppers to maintain a safe distance from each other. When I'm done shopping and ready to pay, I stand in line at least six feet from the shopper in front of me. After unloading my cart at checkout, I go past the cashier to the end of the counter and I pack my own bags. That's one less person touching my groceries and it's less of a burden on the store's employees. I thank the cashier and leave the store. On my drive home, I'm careful not to touch my face. I leave my outside shoes on the porch and as soon as I get through the door, I wash my hands for at least 20 seconds. Next, I wipe down my debit card, ID and my car key. Then I wipe down the front doorknob, clean the sink taps and wash my hands again. I wash my vegetables in cold water and remove the packaging from my proteins and other items. I leave the non-perishables in my garage for a few days unless I need them immediately. My refrigerated items get a quick wipe down just to be on the safe side. And of course, I wash my hands again. Here's a quick recap of my visit to the grocery store. And that's it for this episode. I hope you found it helpful. For SFGov TV, I'm Chris Manners. Thanks for watching.